for any trumpet player, it's like it's like an essential component of what we do. Uh, people pr don't practice enough articulation. They need to practice articulation in many different strokes, long, short. They need to practice it fast. They need to practice it slowly. They need to practice double and triple tonguing. You know the one, red leather, yellow leather, red leather, yellow leather? You've heard that one, right? Right. Something like that is good, too. Walking around the street doing that. I mean, you guys in the Coast Guard got a lot of time. You should be doing that. You know, you get, you, you're you not working this morning. I mean, you know, you're down here. You know, you're not even in uniform. I wish you would be in uniform when you came to see me. I'd feel much better, much safer. And articulation, uh, this is something that's always been difficult for me because I have such a slow single tone. Um, Chris Gecker's book on articulation is really good. And one of the first things, I mean, I don't know if it was his exercise or Herbert L. Clark, second line G, playing it for a minute at a speed that's very relaxed. Um, and doing that and then slowly tick up the metronome over a period of time, like a year. You, know, you go slowly to in increase your speed because you're training your muscle, muscle of the tongue. Um, you need to have a lot of different articulations just to be expressive. So articulation is very important. If you look at the Arben book, the beginning of the Arben book, there are no slurs, it's all articulated notes to get it so you're coordinating the air, your lips, and your tongue. I mean, it's, you know, maybe the most important thing. Something to be practiced diligently every day.